All right, here's your super quick and easy training on how to write a GURP note. Hi, I'm Dr. Melissa McCaffrey, founder of the free private practice paperwork crash course. And we're gonna break down goal, intervention, response, and plan. Those are the sections of a GURP note. For goal, you'll include whatever treatment goals you have on the client's treatment plan and that you were working on in that session today or for this progress note. For intervention, you'll include anything that you do. So it should only be actions that you as the therapist have taken. What did you provide in the session? And as I always say, it is okay here and preferable to not write full sentences. Just add some bullet points of phrases that are personalized to this session and this client. In the response, you're going to include your mini mental status, which is the client presentation. And I recommend focusing only on mood affect behavior for most private practice clients. Again, with words or very small two to three word phrases. Then you'll also add any statements from the client, any client quotes and their progress statement. So what was their progress towards those goals in this session and what are their ongoing challenges or impairments? Here, you can also outline what were the topics discussed. So, you know, client reviewed the following topics, colon, and then list them out in one or two word phrases, ideally as bullet points, and keep it short and sweet. Then you'll include your plan, which as always is anything you, the therapist, plan to do before the next session, anything you have recommended or that the client plans to do before the next session, and when is that next session actually happening. Hope you've enjoyed this quick and easy series on what to put in some of the most popular progress note templates.